Welcome to my reaction to episode 127 of Gintama. Shinpachi has a pen pal, or uh, he has a pen pal who has a sister, whatever. But either way, uh, I have no idea what's actually going to happen with this now that uh, they've been writing the letter for the whole last episode where we're going to go with these girls. So let's get into it with the new OP and ED and all that shit in three, two, one. <clears throat> so as usual, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the videos. Gintama comes out on Tuesdays and Thursdays, or you can see the episodes early on Patreon. You can also check out my, check out my second channel to see other videos that I make. That stuff is linked down in the description below. Thank you. Did he have a just away on his shirt, or was that something else? Anyway. <laughs> is is that Hattori with Hedoro? Once again, I was like, who is that with him? It, it might be. I don't know. Haven't seen Hattori in a while, and uh, his voice actor, Keiji Fujiwara, recently passed away, so... That'll be, uh, interesting when we finally see him again. <clears throat> okay. So this girl just has a picture of Okita. He has a picture of the girl's sister. <clears throat> I mean, technically he's in the picture too, but... Ah, uh, she didn't know. <clears throat> you think you're not cute? Wow. Really? I like the glasses look, so, you know, I'm all for it. There are things you can't understand unless you've experienced them. Uh, yeah, sure. So how the fuck is this happening? How is this working? How are they getting the letters to each other? How is it just happening to get to them every time? Am I just supposed to completely suspend my disbelief for that? <clears throat> I mean, I can do that because it's a comedy, but, you know, it's just like, it's a little weird. Yeah, you didn't technically say which person in the picture was Shinpachi, and if she thought the wrong thing, I guess that's on her. Right? Hi. Hi. You have to stalk her for years before you get anywhere near the front gate.
Did you have a pen pal once? Were they just people manipulating you for money? Yeah, uh-huh. The way they touched his heart was real. Is that worth it? Does that count? I, I think not, because uh, it's kind of you just fooling yourself. Ugh. You don't want her to picture that. Well, you know what? When you say it like that, now we just gotta lie entirely. I wonder what her deal is, what her life is like. I've done badass things with swords, though, you know? I've cut a dude's arm off, it was pretty cool. Been on a lot of adventures. I'm one of the main characters in the anime Gintama. Maybe you've heard of it? Embellish a little bit. I mean, yeah, you know. Is that... Okay, well now, you're, now you are lying. Uh, but circling around to the truth in a weird way. Not the worst. Correct. Sound That sounds admirable. Well. Okay, yeah, that's your that's your input. We can we can delete that. Now we're just talking about how it sounds like he wants to fuck his sister, and that's not going to be appealing. Maybe it would be. Maybe she'd be into that. She'd be like, I want to fuck your, you and your sister together. And she'd just be good with it. But then she'd get here, and he doesn't want to fuck his sister, and she'd be like, well, fuck. Probably not going to happen. How long are we... Goddamn, Kondo, you've been thinking about this a lot, huh? You had this all scripted out in your head this whole time. Like, you... Holy shit. Oh, okay. Good idea. That'll work. <clears throat> like she doesn't already know. <laughs> I mean, you know. If it's relevant, she might think it's nice you have a close relationship with a sibling. But it can wait. <clears throat> we can just talk about getting boners. I get boners all the time. How about that? And she has a sister, so maybe she'll want to bring her sister in and you'll have just a whole fucking thing going on with all the sisters. Nah. So he did mention it. Oh, she's older. Is she? She seemed fine. Is she lying? Just to... Just... Seems like she's rich. She's got a fucking butler. <clears throat> Sebastian. Maybe she's the one who's sickly, even though she kind of seems fine, too. Okay, yeah, she's the sick one.
How many sickly girls have we had in this show? There was the one who befriended the Kappa. Okita's sister. This girl. There was the sickly, uh, the guy. Um, fucking Ito's brother. All these people getting sick. You know, medical technology was not as, van as advanced yet. That one guy, like, wasn't it, like, the baby, the little Gintoki baby, like, his dad was sick? Or there was some other sick guy at some point. I don't remember exactly. Okay. The fuck? All right, man. Not only do you believe in that blood type sh shit, uh, you think you can tell their blood type by looking at them. Interesting. <clears throat> I'm an Aries. It means literally nothing. I'm I'm reading I'm getting a reading on your horoscope that you um have had hard times in life and uh want things. How did you know? You fucking genius. Sounds good. Oh, <laughs> smooth. Good segue, yeah. Speaking of opening. <laughs> um. He didn't even try. <clears throat> Man, when I think about your sick sister, oh shit, that gets me going. <coughs> what if you just had a fetish for sick girls? That's definitely a thing. Some people are into that. Do you like mayonnaise? What are you fucking light, Yagami? Oh, uh, what? Okay. He fucking did it. He's the follow man. You think he's not going to follow up, but he's going to do it. Wait, what? Why did he erase it? You got to leave it like a mystery? Oh, shit. What a fucking genius. A god among men. <coughs> D 
Did they? <clears throat> it's a creepy laugh. Photo Kata Toshi Photo. Wait. Elizabeth. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Oh, God. Yeah. What do you think about that? Oh, that's what that means? Might He just might be schizophrenic. He's has, has got multiple personalities. Well, that uh, that could have gone a lot worse. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it actually included. When I think about your sister, gets me up. So sister's not into him, but she's still good. She's still on board. Okay, somehow that worked out. It's all your fault, Kondo. You wrote it in the first place. <clears throat> but it's all good. It's fine. They have no idea how, but it's fine. And Okita's not even involved here, even though he's the one in the picture. <laughs> she wants to have a threesome with her sister. Or that. Uh, that's probably like the age where it's gonna happen, but I mean... 20? Well, here they are. No, you gotta do it, and you gotta confront him face to face. By the way, Glasses Girl is definitely cuter than her sister. Definitely. Uh huh. I mean, if you cut her hair, she would just be Shinpachi, so am I saying that Shinpachi is cute? Maybe I am. I've never said that he's not. Katsura is really hot when he wears a wig. Or, it's not even the wig, it's probably just his hair. But when he dresses like a woman. <clears throat> okay. Uh, not today, I guess. She's not ready. Oh god, Okita, why? Damn it, Shinpachi, I knew it. I knew this would happen. No, you didn't. It wasn't his idea to do this. He didn't chicken out. They did this without his knowing. Yeah. 
So now two people who have not been communicating are talking, are hanging out. <clears throat> the moon or tortoise poop. Okay. Sure. Is this all necessary? What a crafty villain. <clears throat> I guess he's good with it. She's looking for him. How did he slip away like that and just go around the corner without her knowing? That's kind of cute. <laughs> Hate them, but you know, be gentle with Shinpachi. He's my brother-in-law. How does she not see him? He's right there! Okay, she's looking for her sister. I thought she was looking for him. The real ones, they're meeting. Will they be able to tell? Will there be a connection? Okay, I guess I will have to wait and find out. We're going into part three. Okay, I liked that one better than the last one. Um, this is not one of my favorite arcs still. It's just not really that interesting, but it, it, was, it was better. Um, it was okay. It had some funny bits, like forgetting, like, I like uh, the follow man, and I like him forgetting to fur to erase Kondo's line, and getting to see a little bit more of her, and it was alright, it was decent. It's just not, there's not a lot going on. It, it's, that's really all it is. They're just writing letters back and forth most of the episode. And now they've met, so... Just like I was more curious to see this episode, I'm even more curious to see the next one, because now they're actually here in person. So whatever weird roundabout shit they're going to have to go through to identify themselves, I don't know. But I'd like to see how it ends. Um, I think part of what makes it kind of uninteresting is that I know it's not going to go anywhere, because it's Shonen and, and it's Gintama. Like, they're not going to fucking date and then they're just in a relationship now you know it's not gonna happen romantic development is just not a thing that happens in shonen jump so it's probably not really gonna amount to anything so it's like okay yeah it's it's fine it's cute sure but you know not the most interesting arc that's ever happened so anyway though uh we'll, we'll see what happens next time. Let me know your thoughts on this arc and how you feel about it. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later.